you have seen all of them. You have seen Spider-Man Homecoming. I have. All right. Now, you recall at the end, we see that Nick Fury is actually Talos undercover for Nick Fury. Oh, right. Here's a question I want to ask you. How many times when we've seen Nick Fury, has it actually been Nick Fury? And when has it been Talos? Oh. Follow-up question. Is there a real Maria Hill or is it always Soren? Because we know there's a real Nick Fury. Because, you know, yeah. he's the guy who met Talos in Captain Marvel. Let's yeah. assume like, like, you know, in Iron Man and, the, and maybe all the phase one stuff. That's Nick Fury, Nick Fury. But when did Nick Fury decide he had to go off into space and start doing whatever he's doing in space with the scrolls? Like, you know, what was that? Uh, was that after Avengers Age of Ultron? Was that, you know, or was it, you know, was was the Nick Fury who goes who okay my, in the end? hairs <laughs> on my arm just went up. You have literally blown my mind. When what do you think? Uh, I, I think it was after Age of Ultron. I think if it was not always, then we had a significant periods where Talos was covering for him, which still also allows us for having a real Maria Hill. Although, yeah, there has to be a real Maria Hill. I want there to be a real Maria Hill. I love Maria Hill. Colby Smulders is amazing as that character. I honestly wish uh, that we could see more of her in the role.